Good morning. Today I'd like to show you how to download the customizable Lego brick from Thingiverse 61, 52, 56 and customize that to make math manipulables. You'll start by downloading the Lego SCAD file and you can just click that and save the file. So this is this is Linux and you'll have to uh, do it accordingly in Windows. Into OpenSCAD and I've got that going over here and you'll see they've got you started with a two by six brick. Great thing now is that um, we're gonna change this to two by eight is gonna be our first brick and redraw it and you're done, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna create an eight by brick, a four by, a two by, and a one by. So we've got our eight by, so let's render that. And that'll just take a few seconds. I'm gonna pause while that's doing that. Okay, so I don't like that, that it's not quite um, the, the face numbers or fragment numbers. is a little low for my taste. And it might be okay for yours. Uh, you know, that's certainly a taste thing. So I'm just going to bump it up a little bit to 50. That should be good. I don't think... Your printer may not capture that difference. So that's why they may have just left it there. But um, now it looks pretty at least. So now uh, I'm going to leave that at 8. So we're going to re-render that. And I'll be right back after that finishes okay so so rent the render for that is finished now we're going to create an STL so to create an STL you just click on this icon here and I've, I'm going to pick my recent file here and I've I've created all of them but for the sake of the video I wanted to show you it again so I'm going to be saving it to the 2 by 8 STL and we're going to just replace that. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to change the block length to 4, redraw it, recompile it. That was really fast, okay. And create a new STL. So same thing, I'm going to, I'm going to do the 2 by 4 STL and replace it. So let's go down to a 2, redraw, recompile, and STL. I'm suspicious of this super fast compile. Maybe it's just remembering pieces of it. I don't know. We'll find out. And let's do the two by one. And that's that. Okay. So now we're going to go over to Cura and load these up on a plate. Okay, so now we're over in Cura. I'm going to load up the four Lego pieces that we rendered on OpenSCAD. And I'll load onto the plate. And that's it. You can print these, you can just print these um, you know, they're ready to go as is. Or if you want to have more of each, you can go in and you can do multiply object. You know, get more of them. Which I, you know, I recommend doing that. You know, um, so this, so this number of bricks, let's see how long it takes. And th so this is at uh, 0.15. That's a really slow sprint, print speed. Most printers can go faster than that. So let's bump it up to 60 and see what it looks like after that. Yeah, so that's not too bad. Two hours, longer than I like to wait. But hey, so and I, you know, I think if you, um, there might be some other models that print faster than this. I don't know. You know, this this is printing some detail that you might not need. I like can see if it's yeah. Oh, these yeah. These walls are really thick. I'll have to check on check if they need to be that thick. These something doesn't seem right about these. Okay. Well, I haven't printed one of these, so I'm going to try to print one, and I'll let you know how that comes out, um, and to see if it if, if it meshes with other Lego bricks that I've printed. I have uh, one on file that I've printed that worked really nice and was perfect and printed, I think printed faster than this. So, um, but that doesn't seem too long. One hour, 37 minutes. Sorry for the buzzing on this video. I listened to some of the videos and some of the pieces and I heard some buzzing. I have a cheap microphone and I'm just getting started in this. So I'll upgrade it when I get some revenue. So if you like this, uh, please subscribe, click the, ring the bell for notifications. Um, like it if you like this video. Um, and uh, it was, uh, and thank you. Have a great day.